and welcome to BBC Points West with David and Alex. Our main story tonight, in the last hour, three new cases of coronavirus have been announced in Wiltshire. As the numbers increase, there's concern for workers on the front line. Taxi drivers at railways and airports are urged to protect themselves and their passengers by keeping their vehicles clean. A virus only needs a little bit of space, doesn't it? And uh, once it jumps onto the next uh, victim, then that's it. We'll have the latest information about the Wiltshire infections. Our other headlines tonight, the collapse of Flybe, but some flights operated by a franchise from Bristol to Jersey will continue. I just eat because I'm bored. Crisps, cakes, yogurts. An alert about obese children. We speak to a doctor helping youngsters who weigh 16 stone. And Band of Gold, the hit TV series of the 90s, takes to the stage in Cheltenham and Bath. A very good evening. Within the past hour, it's been confirmed that three people in Wiltshire have been diagnosed as having coronavirus. All three are known to each other. Andrew Plant is with us and has the latest details. Andrew, what can you tell us? Well, until today, we thought there was only two cases here. So at the weekend, we had the very first two confirmed. They were both in Tetbury in Gloucestershire. One person associated with the primary school. Both had recently returned from northern Italy. And then suddenly today, news that across the southwest, we've got 15 cases. That includes Devon and Cornwall, not just our broadcasting patch here. Uh, but very specifically, as you say, three now in Wiltshire. Now, they don't tell us exactly where those people are based, but we do know those are three adults. They've also returned from northern Italy recently. And interestingly, they're not in hospital. We're told they're self-isolating at home. Public Health England say they're tracing contacts. So looking for people that they've been in touch with over the past few days, they've had contact with, and giving them advice as well. Now, those other 15 cases we know includes at least one in Cornwall. We know that from about four o'clock this afternoon. Cornwall Council saying they've got one confirmed case there. We've got two in Devon. The two we previously had from the weekend in Tetbury in Gloucestershire and now three in Wiltshire. That makes eight in total, but there are 15 in this region somewhere. So that means there are seven more. We don't know exactly where those seven are, but we expect to find out more about those seven cases a bit later, possibly tomorrow. OK, yeah, I'm sure we'll get a lot Thank more details. You, Thanks, Andrew.